pee their pants. Yeah. A little bit. A little That's bit great. So, the corridor keeps going. If you want, it also goes back the way you came. And this area is quite loud. Like I said, there's little glowing lights on this on this rectangular yeah, door. There wasn't like a door or anything. No, there was no door. It's like the tunnel like interrupted part of natural caverns here. Yeah. Like it was cut right through here and then something is being done. Um, right. So this clockwork actually connects up to the, the conduits too and to this little board thing. Dun, dun, dun. Further down we go. Okay, you continue on. Uh, another eighth of a mile. Several hundred yards. Uh, the passageway continues straight, but it also another one branches off to your right. Can we see how far do we? Oh wait, no, it's dark. Yeah, it gets dark at only like 30, 40 feet down, and it's just pitch black beyond that. I'm gonna look down the branching path. Uh, you can see down, 40, I mean, 50 feet. At least maybe walk down it just a little bit. How far is a little bit? Uh, maybe. Now it just starts walking down the side like path. Maybe 30 some feet. Okay, it uh, lights up another of the lighting things and continues on the other. I had a scary thought this round. We're deep in a mountain right now. Oh, where's the air? There's no ventilation. Not that you've seen. Well, you still breathe it. You don't know. know. Yeah, you guys aren't having any problems. <laughs> you don't know if you can still breathe. You're yeah. not breathing right yeah. now. <laughs> You're not breathing <laughs> now. You just noticed that. <laughs> what? You haven't been breathing for maybe an hour. No! <laughs> <laughs> I was just like, hmm, that would have been bad. Um, it doesn't, the air seems to be fresh. Okay. Here we go. Just a, just a thought in my head. And I'm like... Mm. Uh, make a listen check. You walk down that corridor. Listen, listen. Oh, you guys still barely make out <laughs> the noise of the other thing behind you guys. Way out there. Scare, scare, scare. No. <laughs> Nothing? Okay. Yeah, you don't hear anything. Down that way. All the way in. Oh shit. Monster. Okay. Down maybe another 10 feet. Okay. Just the thing just keeps going. Although it does curve out of the way, so there could be more down that way. Like I said, all these tunnels, none of them have been straight shot. It's all kind of this kind of mess. So I'm just following him. He's not yeah. alone. Yeah, you're leading now, Nigel. Yeah. There's you. Well, just use this as the direction you're heading. Okay. Rockefeller and Felix are following you. Who's going else is following mm -hmm. you? Okay. You you've crept forward, you're like you look behind you and everybody's just kind of creeping behind you. Right? <laughs> oh, <what> you <laughs> Does he still have the lantern or do I? You have the lantern, but it's not lit because uh, remember those things keep lighting up above your heads. You have to do that. Nigel. You can do the lantern. Back. You can do the lantern. I guess I, I There's guess plenty I, of light, but. <laughs> I mean, will it illuminate any further in front of us than it's already illuminated or? Not appreciably. Um, it's not like there's, it's, it's like once you start walking past one of them, the next one starts to starts to light up. Okay. So what you're getting is just a cascade of, as you move, they light that's pretty good. effectively. The ones behind us turn off. Okay. And then the ones behind fade down to darkness. Correct. I guess just kind of keep moving forward. Okay. Have a slow pace just to be safe. But you walk for maybe uh, a little less than half a mile. You would think you walk in this way when you start oh. hearing noise ahead, and it's more of that same like energy noise that you've heard from all these other little weird node things, mm -hmm. and. Um, you, you, there's like a final curve of the tunnel and you can see this purple light ahead. And um, you see the same kind of thing, except in this case, it's like some kind of vines or weeds are all over the place. And, and at that little, and there's that little thing that sticks up out of the ground with the oh, lights yeah. on it. And at that, there's a thing a that thing. you're not sure what it is. Yeah, yeah a thing. We're all there. It appears to be <laughs> reddish in color. Um, Alcohol. Very strange, a little bigger than a man. Uh, no. Am I the only one who sees yeah. this, or do is there the people behind me see it too? Aha. Hey. What? Do we all see this? You guys would all see it because it's okay. as you come around a kind of a curve. All right. So it's not just like bam. So it's, it's not just me like, oh, look at oh, that. Looks something like that. Pterodactyl. <laughs> Pterodactyl. Ah. Or gargoyle. Yeah, gargoyle. <laughs> uh, kind of like this. It appears to have some kind of glowing nodules on its, what you would expect to be a head. Um, it, it has, it, it almost kind of looks like um, crab-like, um, pinkish, five foot, maybe six foot long, crustaceous body, bearing vast pairs of dorsal fins or membrous wings, several sets of articulate limbs, 
sort of convoluted ellipsoid covered with multitudes of very short antennae. Um, where the head would be, you would think. Uh, it appears to be manipulating the uh, this board in some way, and uh, as far as you can tell, it's got a gun. Is that its hand? It's got a what? It looks like a gun or a hand. Uh, that one, that one might have something. You know, it doesn't have anything that's nipper on the hand. Everybody gets a sanity check. Woo! Yay. Of course. All right. Well, I've seen this before. Someone no, you haven't. <laughs> you have, but your character has. It looks like my brother. <laughs> that bitch. Okay, who made it? Wait, oh, no. zero off. Under is good, right? Under is good. Did you make it? Yeah. Okay. You two. <laughs> All right. Whoops. <laughs> Bricker! Six! Yay. What's your name? One point. Okay. Sixteen. Come on, Fairfield. Do me right. For now. Okay. Oh, six yeah, points of saving loss. This thing is hitting us. Let me check for these guys. Felix, of course, <laughs> is fine because he's gone through the hell of Felix Hills is fine. Right. So yeah. Same with me. And Virgil Man. Thomas. Uh, 30. Virgil, Virgil is, is okay. No, Virgil, Virgil actually pants. makes it too. Virgil pieces of <laughs> Virgil's like Okay, that. make me an idea check. You want to fail this? You want to roll above your idea? Fairfield did not make her sanity check. She is shaken to the core. Yes, I made this. <laughs> You rolled above? Yeah, I rolled above. Okay, okay. Dog on it. Darn. You do not go temporarily insane. Six is a big shock to you, though. Yeah. This thing is probably about... Here, I can, uh, I can just, draw this just little quarter. So you're going to make her eat gummy worms. You will eat, you will eat these little <laughs> gummy worms. That's insanity. how it feels. It feels crazy. You are insane. <laughs> So wait, is it facing us, or what we think would be facing us, or is it facing away? So your quarter kind of does one of these weird kind of things, okay? As you guys reach about this point, you can put your miniatures here in a minute. And then it opens into this jagged kind of, um, okay, looks like, like a meatball. Yeah. Kind of like a meatball, yeah. yeah. And then you've got some, uh, you've got these, some quartz and some weird uh, minerals. And about this area is where that weird board is, where this guy is. He's facing away. Is there any other way out of the room? You think. Now, I need you guys to put your minis here a first. Board? Not that you can see. It was that thing. There's like a pillar that comes up out of the ground. It's about yay high. And then there's a rectangular piece of stone or metal that's hard to tell which with glowing lights on it. You guys have oh, seen that all these things. Yeah, he's DJing. There you go. Did you <laughs> <change the words? laughs> oh, I gotta check to what I laying out some fresh ass beats. Oh, he's just having a run of Thank you. Okay. There's a lot of noise coming from up there too, guys. So even if you guys were like you're not you're not like sneaking, you were just walking. Uh, there's light in that area as well, that greenish glowing light, and then there's a dark patch in between the two of your groups. I'm gonna like I'm gonna do stop. <laughs> okay. Stop section. Bricker was in the lead and he stopped when he saw it. Um, you are like probably shaking like oh. I'm yeah, yeah, it's like <laughs> You know that one's not turning out, but you take it anyway. Yeah. Gonna, there's too much darkness and it's too weird. Oh, um, okay, yeah, yeah. I need knife, uh, Nigel my rifle. I've already got a shotgun. He's got a shotgun, didn't he? Really? Yeah, yeah. I have a freaking shotgun. When, he, when you guys went back to camp for lunch, he grabbed a shotgun. He's had it the whole time. She doesn't have a gun. Oh. Um, I thought Virgil got her. No. Oh. No, no, we talked about it. She, oh. didn't, she didn't get it. She decided oh, she Oh, so everybody right. has a weapon. Everybody except for Miss. Making of meeting. Uh, it's in your pocket though right now, right? So you don't know about her. She doesn't appear to be armed. She doesn't appear to be armed. Uh, Virgil's hand is in his pocket, right. so you don't know if he's armed. You've, made, you've had your suspicions about that. Jebediah okay. has a rifle. I didn't know he had the Felix has, has a rifle as well. And so you've got your rifle. You've also Where? got the lantern in your hand. Is it lit? Mm, no, I didn't lie. Okay, so but you still have it. Yeah. Where did he get the shotgun? Who, him? Yeah. I brought it with him. He brought it with him. Oh, really? Yeah, it was, okay. it was back in the camp in case you want to do some hunting or oh, okay. something like that. Yeah. Right. So here's the lantern just so we don't lose track of it. I mean, we're, we're going to hunt in this we're vacation. Going to hunt. Yeah, it's a vacation. I guess um, in a cult would be like Even oh, skeet shooting, they did have birds. skeet shooting at, at Brown on Beach. So you could have done some oh, skeet doing that with your own gun if you want. Well, I was just making sure because yeah, I only yeah. brought rifles and I didn't bring the shotguns. I thought it was my shotgun. No, no, no. Like, right. I didn't have it. He brought his own. He brought a gun bag and everything. And it was all above board. You guys knew about it, so. Replace that information in your head. Your character knew knew that he had to shoot his own double barrel shotgun. Double barrel. Yeah. You have no idea about her. She does not appear to be armed, except maybe with a cigarette holder. You have one of the long blood. filters, right? Why well, don't? Yeah. She's gonna blow smoke. I don't feel things. like she would be able to use. That's fine. Anyway. So and she doesn't appear to have a gun, but she right now is just doing this. <laughs> <laughs> and it's fair enough. Turn motion. <laughs> mm. What do you want to do? There's energy, there's light noises, there's that purple, weird purple light going on up there. Um, those of you who made the save are like, the fuck? 
that is not a person, and you can only make out part of it from that weird backing curved up, spot. Backing up. You could back do that. and hide. Uh, what's uh, this? The lantern. That's lantern, but it's not lift. I don't have hide or sneak. Um, Virgil pulls out his pistol. So I'm just throwing that out there. He's not aiming or anything, but it, it is out of his pocket now. It is a big pistol. It appears to be a Colt, but the barrel looks larger than a normal pistol barrel. That looks real as fuck. Okay. <laughs> huh? That looks real as fuck. No, well, it's just a prop. It's broken. It's sad. So he has a gun in his hand. What do you guys want to do? I'm over here hiding. So you backed up down the corridor. Uh, probably a light is coming on behind you, which probably startles you slightly. Like, like, Move up a little bit so it goes off. <laughs> well, there's a light in this vicinity, but whatever that thing is, it hasn't noticed it or doesn't care. Well, I, there's like a dark patch still between those lights, right? I want to hide there's where it's here. dark. There's probably a little bit of dark here. There's a light oh, somewhere in this area, then that's, it's dark back behind you. Question. Yes. Okay. yes. yes. Can I, like, 100% make out that Tommy is not somewhere in this area? Uh, he could be over in the corner. <laughs> okay, like, he, there are places, you guys can see this, kind of like that. Yeah. Um, so, obviously the room is larger than what you can see. Uh, uh, Felix has his gun like raised and ready, raised and ready, but he's not taking the shot. He looks to be looking at y'all for to determine what to do. But he does look very nervous. Felix is like after that fucking giant tree thing. I, I think we should explore other areas before we alert whatever that is. He says that. You guys can all hear it. I'm already back. To the Are you going to creep back down yeah, the corridor? Yeah, we're going to turn yeah. Okay, yeah. Back, so back, back down the corridor. Fuck I am going to keep an eye behind us, though, as we're going, just to make sure it's. Well, not yeah, you're bringing up the rear now, so it's the opposite walking down. So you're kind of walking. Kind of walking in a backwards, kind of sideways. Yes, I am. My ass is gone. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't got no um, weapon. I'm gone. <laughs> There could have been other entrances to that room for all you know, though, too. So right. keep all that in mind. You don't know where this goes. You're getting a little bit disoriented as to where you are. Um, this whole go place to, is really strange. I'm actually going to walk back to Virgil. Do you have any more guns on? No way I'm on to grab any of the other big ones. Can I hear this? Do you want this one? Yeah. They're talking quietly. You're all being quiet, but you're, like, grouped fairly close together. And the noise is going away for the further you get away from that. that I area. hand Virgil a rifle, and I say, do you know how to use this? See Is he a rifle? Oh, yes, sir. Well, give her your gun and you can have mine. What do you mean, we'll go for with Are you with a rifle? Uh, he yeah. would know. He would know what you I had the shotgun thing. Right, do you have anything? What's right? Rifle's, Rifle's different. different. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I have a shotgun. Okay. This is all I use. He can hand you off his handgun. Okay. He's yeah. got a massive barrel. It looks like a rifle barrel has been attached no, to like a pistol. I probably have a better time with a rifle since so there's a base 25. Is Those rifle based on Yeah. Oh, yeah, he'll hand you the rifle then. Okay. It's kind of like a shotgun rat. He hands you. No, I just. <laughs> sure. Don't shoot anybody in the back. I'm just nervous right now. Will that leave you with. This is as you're moving away, this conversation's happening. Will that leave you with, Mr. Rockefeller? I'm just like plugging Because you haven't had your pistol out of your pocket yet either. <laughs> this sucks. Uh, man, I always lose my accent. Oh. Don't worry, I've got Felix to protect oh, me. Oh. I just nods at that. Could, could I, like, possibly hear some kind of, like, a resume story about this creature thing? No. No, nothing like this has been in any of your occult stuff. Damn it! That'd be cool. It was a witch. You'd be fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a witch. Or a demon. Yeah. Or a werewolf. Did we get a good enough look at it to recognize if it possibly made those spider tracks? No, you weren't close enough. Okay. You can look at the mini, you can make your determination from that. Um, they haven't told you about the spider tracks. I you you two saw them. You two and Jebediah are the ones who saw the spider I was there because Virgil was there. Oh, they yeah, told us about it on our walk up yeah, the mountain. Yeah. No, that was not. right before you got right before you found them and then went back down into the hole. Mm. Like literally, no, you were I like, wasn't. I was like, oh yeah, no, as I was walking. Right, okay. It was just like right yeah. before. So I was like, I don't know about this, and then I told him to go with you guys. That's right. I wasn't. Oh yeah, Virgil was with us. You. Yes. Virgil Virgil you showed up with the screen because you decided to come back up the mountain afterwards by yourself. I'm surprised Virgil actually came with us and actually left her there. <laughs> he thought she was going to stay safe at camp. He should have known better. He's uh, you guys are walking back down the corridor. Um, you get back to the place where it meets um, the other corridor. So it's essentially, if you flip this around, it's like you guys are coming this way. It's kind of the, this right. was the way you originally came. And this was that side corridor you just checked out. It was a little shaken. Uh, Bricker keeps looking behind but not seeing anything. So we're like here now? If you want to be. Oh. Okay. 
the, the corner that you originally followed, remember, had a cut to the right, and then you followed it, and you came to this place. Right. So we've already explored everything up that so way. So we'd be coming back up from this way. Yeah, you'd be coming from this way, and you initially came from that way. So going this way leads to the unknown. Yes, to Let's the unknown. Way. Woo. All right, everybody, come on. Okay, oh, who's still leading this time? I'm still leading. <laughs> You're leading. <laughs> I'm just like coming out. <laughs> I'm going to wait for the thing. I'm rifle in hand. hand. No, you have the yeah, you have the rifle, don't you? Yeah. Keep that in mind. You're, you're holding a sprint for the rifle. If you need the stats, Kyle, I think has it written down in his character. Yeah, I do. Okay. I guess I can still figure out how to like, load it. Really it's a bold action rifle. You've seen it before. Okay. Um, you know how to, you would know. How to function. Yeah, you would know how to, that you got to work the bolt after so you well. fire. <laughs> You've seen your bed. Exactly. <laughs> Mrs. Eddington, do you believe that you should be in the front? If you want to take the lead, Mrs. Rockefeller, by all means. I just think it might be safe for that way. <laughs> I just want away from that. Bricka, you get, who the fuck am I? <laughs> Am I watching that Nazi guy? <laughs> <laughs> I'm kind of keeping it. Close. Yeah, I'm dead Jebediah. Look Jebediah like looks a little shaken by this whole situation. Keeps looking around. I've He's never said it in character, but I do really want somebody to watch. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, so if no, you I'm haven't said it in character, then I know. I, know. I, I meant to tell Nigel, but I forgot to tell him. No, I kind of do it on my own. Like, yeah, I'm still thinking he looks kind of shady, too. Okay. And I'm like, mm. You guys head on down this way. This leads all the way. North Carolinian. Uh, everybody can make me a listen check. I'm Jordan's. No. Where's my listen? Hey, listen, listen, listen. I'm looking at the wrong thing. Just kidding. Oh, wait, yeah, my listen's good. It's my spot hidden, so. Critical failure. You know. Okay. Listen, who made a listen check? Miss Fairfield and Mr. Rockefeller. Uh, somewhere behind you hear like a buzzing and a humming. Oh, fuck that. Like you black for a little while, and then it seems to go away. Is it the same machinery? No, no, no. It's, oh. more, of a, it's more, of, yeah. more of a high-pitched whine that seems to come closer. You look behind you, you guys, and then it seems to move away. You know what I mean? And it sounded like it was far off. So whatever okay. you want to take that to mean. You've only been walking for a it's couple, two or three minutes. It was. Okay. Yes. And now it's gone. Let's put a little pep in our step. <laughs> That's all you said. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And I walk a little faster than I have been. <laughs> Okay. This quarter seems to go forever. It just goes on and on and on and on. Uh, maybe it walk, goes for maybe a mile. Um, possibly more. It's hard to tell. You're losing track of time. You're losing track of distance. And this weird green. The green is starting to make your eyes hurt. Um, when you come to a place where the corridor kind of has been curving to your left, and then there's another corridor that comes off of it, and it kind of makes like a Y shape in the spot. Yeah. So it kind of goes off to your left and to your right. Uh, both are kind of like a, this kind of this kind of an angle for you guys, as your corridor came up in a curve. Um, scissors a thing back then. Or what? <laughs> it's scissors a thing. I think rock paper scissors. Kind of like a pinky swear was. Yeah, yeah I was like, like whoa. You got a pocket full of change. Point to it. Let's not take it. Just roll a die. And Miss decide what's like heads and what's tails and what that means. That's the easiest way to do a coin flip. I don't think I know. You do like. Just do a six. Do a six yeah, and say like one to three is heads and okay, okay. four to yeah, six is tails. Or one and two is heads and four to six. One and two is heads, three and four, three and four is tails. tails. And it is tails. Tails, so what did that mean? Right. Okay, fair enough. Heads, tails. She takes a coin out, flips it, and then kind of points to the right way. And I'm just like, yeah, sure, why not? Works as well as any other way, I guess. Um, okay. It's best if you come back and go the other way. You guys head down that corridor. Again, time passes. Another eighth of a mile, it splits again. Same kind of deal. Kind of a, a Y split. Um, you can hear like a rumbling ahead on the right. Again, that energy kind of thing, but it sounds like it's pretty far off. I want to stick to the right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, fair enough. Uh, after a very short, maybe a sixteenth of a mile, just a couple hundred yards, you come across another one of these places where the corridor goes by one of these weird areas where this purple energy is uh, that the conduits come to. It's got that board thing that's sitting in front of it, and there are, oh wait a minute, let's see if anybody's here. Oh, damn it. Uh, doesn't appear to be any, anybody there. Um, uh, in this case, there is um, the, it's the, the things that are connected to the, to the, the strange energy producing things are, they almost look like they're flush. It's like wires or cords made out of like skin that connect to the board and connect to the conduits. And the corridor continues on beyond this. 
Maybe it's something else. It's just weird. It's like the right color to be like. Oh, I'm gonna peer flesh. in and look around it's and make sure nobody is there. <laughs> so the place where there's like a natural cavern, small natural cavern, that the tunnel intersects and continues on beyond. Can we look at the board? We haven't looked at the board. Sure. Yet, right? It's rectangular in shape. It has strange lights, glowing um, shapes, knobs of some kind, strange, uh, strange markings on it. Nothing is familiar. Who the mythos? Hey, let me, let me try that. Now, this is new enough, and I would like. I need some Google Mythos. Go crazy. Um, yes. If she'd have gone temporary insane, she would have gotten five points. Uh, yeah. Wouldn't that have been awesome? Okay. But she could have turned around and just shot us. You know? She could have. Just started snapping oh. pictures madly. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't have a gun. She only has a camera. They move, they know. Um, it's got a cut and concealed side. I want to push one button. Okay. Uh, make a roll. Make me a personal roll. What the hell? Oh, what are you doing? <laughs> I tell everyone to stand back. He just walks up to the panel and he's like... I'm going back to the entrance then. He just does this. I'm like ready is to it run. a button? You're not sure. It's lit. I want to figure out what this is. Cool. I want to find Tommy as fast as possible. 36. 36? Uh, nothing apparently happens. <laughs> you push it, it goes dark. Uh, that little tiny part of the board. I'm going to go um, keep watching the corridor for <laughs> Okay. Just in case something shows up with him matching. But other than that, you're like, you don't see any discernible effect. I'm already in the corridor hiding, like, nope. <laughs> Another one. <laughs> okay, I'm make a roll. D1. Okay. Um, what's your luck? Mm. Oh, shit. <laughs> 50. 50, okay. Perfect. Uh, you push another one. Uh, it goes dark, but then it starts, that area starts to flash. On the board? Yeah, that little thing that you pushed. It was like a little weird. So you pushed one, it was kind of flat. This is a knob. You kind of messed with it and it kind of turned or something. And then it starts to, there's a little like flash in it. And a weird psychedelic color, like a purplish greenish that changes constantly. Felix, stay with me. Everyone else, back up. I'm what do y'all do? You've already backed I'm up. I'm already in the corner. Yeah, like, with the team watch. Okay. Is everybody backing up? Virgil will too. Jebediah's like, do you know what you're doing? Virgil, Did you see that thing? It's crazy. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say, Virgil, if this goes to shit, help them out, please. <laughs> I'll do my best. <laughs> this goes to shit. There's a conversation kind of happening we back there. You're having Tommy. trouble hearing it because of all this like this cascading Tommy button. Like, <laughs> stuff. But other than Sorry. that, nothing apparently happened. Sorry. Other than this weird flashing that's on the door. And some lights are turning on and off at random, it seems to you, as far as you can tell. Uh, you mess with another one. Mm -hmm. That one changed color. That one, yeah. <laughs> Screw it! <laughs> I mean, honestly, that's where we're at. 93? Nothing happened. That one didn't do anything when you touched it. It didn't even change color. Just like, do I need to keep rolling? Because I'm just going to like start hitting buttons. <laughs> <laughs> virtual is like, uh, virtual is like, are you sure this is wise, sir? Okay. Your luck is 50, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah okay. You push another one, nothing seems to happen. Uh, you push when you push that one, another part of the board lit up, and it seems to be like um, it seems to be like it's weird. It's like different lights are like kind of like there's like a color cascade, like all these different lights in a different weird pattern over on one side of your board when you press that one. Mm. No Mr. idea what it means. What? Mr. Rockefeller, I don't think anything's happening. Something's happening. I just don't <laughs> know what it's doing. <laughs> It might be alerting the alien. I'm getting, I'm getting a little bit. Like, I'm just gonna go over there okay. and just be like. That one went out too. Dark. I'm gonna poke something. <laughs> You're pushing buttons too again. Might as well. Cause I'm like, this is happening at 30 feet. Okay. What's your luck? Oh, 70. Um, that where she she reaches over and she's like, and then one of the ones that went dark for you comes back lit. I had that one dark. <laughs> I don't know if they're supposed to be all lit up or dark. I don't understand any of this. Yeah, don't. Like, it doesn't make any sense at all. Ooh, that's a good one. <laughs> Just because it goes far doesn't make it a good roll. Did you see how it rolled? <laughs> it missed the entire party. Well, that's true. Um, and a giant tie comes more, uh, more, more different, like, the, the, color, the color thing changes that was, like, making different colors and stuff. I want to... Oh shit! Okay. I'm gonna just, like jump back. What? Boom! Just, okay. just one. Just okay, one. Just like, make me roll. Make me roll. Hurt your hand. Where's Tommy? Oh wow. Okay. Where's Everything seems to like reset. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. you know, all the lights that were off come back on. The, all that little like scrolling weird like light thing just kind of stops and goes back to what it was before. I need um, 
everything seems to, as far as you can tell now, there's a lot of different lights and stuff. Maybe things are different that you just didn't notice. This electrical board is broke, and it does <laughs> nothing. It doesn't seem to be electricity, sir. What'd you say, Pat? It doesn't seem to be electricity. I've never seen anything quite like this. Well, what would it be, then? I don't know. You said it's broken, like, probably because you hit it. It's all just lit up now. I'm going to go look at this other stuff over here. What other stuff? Oh, the cascading yeah, energy and shit? Um, what you're getting is that it looks like the energy is actually moving into these weird conduit tubes or whatever that are connected to the conduits. Oh, touch you're touching the energy? No, I'm touching the tubes. Oh, uh, it's warm. <laughs> Andy got excited. No. You're touching that <laughs> energy? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's that energy warm and it, it almost feels like it's alive. Maybe that's just whatever's going through. Uh -huh. Yeah, it does. It kind of gives just slightly when you push on it. It feels soft, or like flesh. Uh, it feels very soft. Plant? Could be. Could be flesh. Does it go anywhere, or does it just go into a wall? Uh, it goes into these conduits, and some of them connect directly up to the board that he's still looking at right now. Apparently, quite annoyed at. Oh yeah. I'm gonna like go back to this table and look underneath. I guess if that's where it is. Oh uh, yeah, what it does is it one of them, two of them run right to like this base. It's like um, it looks like it's made of stone, and then the actual tablet or the table itself looks almost made of stone or some kind of metal you don't recognize. Um, and it just they both run into like the base of where it comes up from the ground. It almost looks like it's made of the same kind of glass-like material that, that the walls are made of. Virgil, Felix, Nigel, let's see if we can move this. I want to try. They're trying to lift it. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, yeah. You guys. The way, then. Okay. Yeah, sure. You guys. Uh, uh, let's see. Sorry to leave Jebediah Felix, out. But Felix like puts uh, Felix puts the Springfield on his shoulder. Um, Virgil. Virgil gave you the rifle, right? Yeah. He, he's put his pistol away again already by this time. Uh, he comes over, and uh, Nigel. Are you gonna go over there? Yeah. Oh, is he like? Yeah. <laughs> you ain't paying me enough for this shit. You ain't paying me that. Um, you guys grab it. It does feel like stone. It's almost like a glass, like like super super carved or super well polished stone. And you heave. Um, All of us roll strength. Mm -hmm. Oh, we, we don't even have. You have to figure out the cheat. What what is everybody's what's every strength? Five. Fourteen. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're not helping. Them. Everybody who's grabbing this thing. Oh. What is your? It's like it's like a table. We're Nine on four five. Sides. Felix. I really want them to fail, the and then I can 13, go over 12, there. <laughs> 13, 25, 39, divided by 4, 40, it's about a 10. So whoever wants to roll basically a 50% chance. Go for it, Colin. Over, over. Because then you just, under success, over the fail. Because um, you're trying, you're just trying to. So I have to get under 50 or under. Under 50 or 50 or less, correct. In order to. Oh. Okay, you guys just, it, it doesn't even, do it doesn't do anything. It's just like, ah. Oh. Uh, it appears to be oh, very solidly like connected to this, again, like this polished pole that almost appears to be stone or possibly some kind of a polished metal. Was this a one-time roll or can we try again? Mm, this is pretty much a one-time roll. Okay. If the four of you together can't get this to move, it's probably not going to move. Okay, I was getting frustrated. It's at least what goes in your head. Well, that, that, you could still do that, okay. and you can try it a few times, but that was the role to see if the four of you would be able to do it. Well, we tried a few times, but we'll yeah, you can do that. It's 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 solidly connected. Is there any yeah. loose stones? Is there loose stones? Yeah. Uh, no. no. Actually, there's none. Mm -hmm. It's like the whole place that you've been in so far is like super clean, Go and super clear. Some of the energy. See what it does. I just want to figure out how all of this well, works. Yeah, you have change in your pocket. You have. I'll throw a quarter in there. Okay. You just toss a quarter towards these quartz things that are just like. Um, like the energy, like the actual yeah, it's like cascading around the quartz and around all the, the different metal that's like outside of where you guys are. <laughs> she she pulls something out of her pocket. It's very small. You guys would all notice this, and just kind of just like this, or you just I'm like and just tosses it towards. Uh, there's only the slightest of hisses, and then it's gone. It just goes. It's just gone. Yep. That's how we saw <laughs> it. Everybody notices this. It's just, I'm just like, yep. And then I walk over. There doesn't appear to be like anything around where this energy is either. Like literally you could walk over and be like, what's this energy? And stick your hand in. Yeah. That's what Tommy did. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> that would suck. You probably like, did. Throw Jeff and I Let's see what happens to it. Hey, Jeff and touch it. Home. That's what you see. 
I think we should explore the way we came. This place. You could. Give me back to the fork and try the other. You could. You could go back to the last fork or the fork before that. There's been two forks. Yeah, we, we're just gonna like we're hitting like the fork that we come to again and then going that other way. Then we'll come back and go to the other fork and go that other okay, way. Okay, so you're going to the nearest or fork first? Yes. Back. Yes. Yeah. Okay, fair enough. Um, you head back up and you head to, to your right this time was the left right. last time. Um, uh, you again, curvy, curvy, curvy for probably half a mile, maybe longer. Uh, when you run into something like this again. Uh, it's another, it could be a dead end. It, most of the ones that go past the areas go straight by it. The, this one reminds you of that one and the fact that it goes like directly into one of these areas and you see another one of these things. Uh, maybe the same one, it's hard to tell. Uh, everybody can make a sanity check upon spotting another one of these terrible creatures that you're like, the fuck? Let's check for this Maybe, thank God. Yeah, that's time. Okay, Felix is fine. Virgil uh, well, is fine. Oh, oh Joey Dye is fine. Totally I know. Did anybody not make it besides Caitlin? Caitlin! I did. Um, Montana. Well, we have to see how much you lose first. I want all of it. Only two. Sorry. <laughs> she wants to be crazy and kill the party. No, yeah, I, I, I want Cthulhu Mythos. Okay. Let's go. Oh, that's true. Oh, wait, let's start this.